Our ball now tracks 6423. You have uh, satellites, you have radars, you have a command and control system, and you have interceptors. S satellites pick up signals if a ballistic missile is launched from somewhere. The radars afterwards pick up the trace of a uh, ballistic missile, and then afterwards, through command and control, uh, you pass on this information to the interceptors that are eventually able to intercept these missiles. In a world of new and evolving threats, the number and sophistication of ballistic missiles available to NATO's potential opponents is constantly increasing. So what if a hostile missile was launched against a NATO nation? In this case, there would be only minutes to react. NATO's ballistic missile defense system uses networked sensors and interceptors that provide layered defense. Firstly, sensors detect the launch and constantly track the missile's flight. As the missile continues on its path, NATO's systems calculate its trajectory, evaluates the threat, and determines the best option for interception. NATO systems also provide warnings on the predicted impact areas to alert national authorities. Once the threat is pinpointed, the best suited interceptor launches from sea or from land to neutralize the attacking missile, protecting NATO populations, territories, and forces. I see missile lens is just an extra tool in addition to the other tools that we have to defend ourselves if needed. NATO ballistic missile defense is not directed against any specific country.